Salutations and welcome back to the Hypixel Network. We're going to be playing some more Skywars today and trying to enjoy ourselves. So I was trying to come up with a video idea and now normally I have to spend exorbitant amounts of time coming up with video ideas because I am generally pretty poor at coming up with video ideas. Um, I, I'm just not a very idea-filled person normally. Um, but this time I decided to kind of try something different, and I looked up and observed my favorite Skywars role model. And uh, for anyone who, <laughs> who wants to guess, uh, I, I won't make you guess. My favorite Skywars role model is Technoblade. Now, Technoblade is a very skilled player for anyone who doesn't know who Technoblade is, for anyone who hasn't learned of Technoblade skill, I'm just gonna get utterly destroyed real quick. Let me stop that. Generally though, one of the one of the things that I've noticed with Technoblade and now I imagine that this probably would <laughs> would have changed with the times considering the uh, the skill level of the average Skywars player is it, it might be lower, but like on average you are going to face much more difficult opponents in any given Skywars game, even if the average skill level is moderately low. I don't know where this person is. Um, I heard something though, so apparently they were just behind me the entire time. Now, when I watch Technoblade, there is... well, when I watch Technoblade's older uh, Skywars content, I, I generally notice a trend that he is... Um, when, when he fights a lot of people, he generally, generally, uh, is successful because the people that he's fighting are not actually that great at the game. Now, obviously I'm not saying that the only reason that Technoblade ever wins anything is because he only fights people who are bad at the game. That would be a ridiculous claim, um, but I, I am saying that it does contribute pretty heavily to a lot of his past Skywars uh, stuff, right? A lot of uh, the Skywars games that he's fought, that he wins in, the people that he's fighting are not that great. Um, and that got me thinking that potentially, oh shoot, there's a person there, awesome. Potentially when, when you are fighting a lot of people who are not great at the game, perhaps you might actually experience Skywars a, a little bit different from, like, an average game, right? I, basically what I'm getting at is, when you're fighting a lot of people who are not great at the game, you might find yourself enjoying the game a lot more than usual. Awesome, the skeleton combo, and I'm gonna die anyways because I have no health. When you're fighting a lot of people who are not great at the game, right? You're gonna see a lot more success, and I postulate that you're going to have a lot more fun in the game, right? Cause, like, okay, um, I would like this person to be dead. Uh, and switching away from your sword is not the generally best way for that to be accomplished. Um, but it works out in the end. So, I postulate that, in general, when you're playing Skywars, well, for one thing, it will usually be more fun for you if what you're doing, if you are better at the game, right? Now, that's kind of obvious, honestly, like, <laughs> that, that's, a, that's a pretty obvious statement to make. Um, it probably doesn't even really need to be said, but I'm going to say it anyways. Uh, but another important thing is, uh, and it's kind of a, a counterpoint to this, if everyone else is bad at the game, then you'll also have a lot more fun, right? I actually have ender pearls. I can just, like, kill this person. Or I can not kill this person. I'll kill this person instead. Or, oh, shoot. Please land. Okay, awesome. Incredible. I amaze myself, honestly. I am truly a incredible gamer, he says after almost dying. Um, but yeah, so when, when you fight people who are 
bad at the game as well. And this is this is where uh, Technoblade comes into the mix and all the stuff that I was saying about him. You, you see, in a lot of the, the old Skywars Technoblade YouTube videos, you can see him kind of messing around with a lot of the people, right? You can see him messing around with the, the other people in the game, because they're pretty bad, right? They're, they're, they're moderately bad at the game, so he can afford to just kind of mess around with them. And I'm gonna die, because I have very few healing items. Uh... Please die. Please. Would you consider it? Thank you. So, what I am getting at, in general, with all of this, is that it is normally more fun to fight people who are worse at the game than you are. And again, like I, I, I know that it's just such simple logic and it does not need to be constantly repeated, but I am constantly repeating it, so you're gonna kind of have to deal with it. Um, but yeah, like I watch, I watch Technoblade, I watch people playing Sky Wars and having fun, and what I notice about them is that like towards the end of a round, they will generally be up against somebody who isn't as great at the game, and so instead of, you know, like, instead of just tryharding and fighting and being all, all, you know, super good at the game still, they will usually just kind of mess with the person, right? And, obviously, like, messing with people, you can, you can kind of do that whenever, if you really, if you really set your mind to it, but to do it effectively and still win, which is another part of, like, having fun, goodbye zombie, to do it effectively, you, you, the, the other people kind of need to be pretty poor at the game, right? And so, like, and with, with Technoblade, and this is kind of a side tangent, not really related to um, me trying to have fun. Okay. I, I thought that person might back off and I might be able to demonstrate, but they did not. They just wanted to kill me, and I d <laughs> decided to not let them do that. So I'm gonna go off on a bit of a side tangent here, and so so basically, I, I've been talking about Technoblade a little bit during this episode, and obviously, like, I'm not doing this for, like, clickbait reasons or anything. That would be ridiculous of you to assume that, because I'm not, like, <laughs> I don't have Technoblade in the YouTube video, thumbnail, title, anything. Um, so I don't know where you got that crazy idea from. But when I when I've watched Technoblade and then when I play Sky Wars, I like to try and emulate Technoblade in a lot of his skills, right? Cuz he's he's very good at the game. I don't know what is going on here. Uh this person has no armor and I have loads and that other person had even less armor and I had even more. Um, but yeah, you see, like, Technoblade fights people, and it, it is crazy, and he's good, and he just, like, he's continually talking about random stuff while fighting the people, right? And that's what I want to emulate about him, is he, he, he completely wrecks people, and he does it while talking about random things like, like, soap or, or lasagna, right? And that's, that's what I wish I were able to do. I wish I were able to, like, say, Hey, I'm talking about this thing, and I'm going to uh, continuously destroy this person who is just <laughs> lagging and teleporting all over the place while talking about it, right? And you might say, Oh, go Gyrosel, you already do that. Like, every single one of your videos has something similar to that going on. Uh, no, not really. Um, the thing is, <laughs> right now, you, you might be looking at this, this video's length, and you're like, oh, ten minutes-ish. Uh, it's, it's, it's a moderate length video. Uh, yeah. I had to record, like, about an hour of footage to <laughs> get to this point. Uh, it, it would, it, it's a, it's a long process. If I were to give an estimate, about 90% of the time that I spend recording, I spend losing and doing reshoots and losing again and 
constantly just doing things over and over because like i want to not have my sentences interrupted by me dying or getting comboed or whatever happens in skywars i don't even know what happens in skywars man it's ridiculous but either way that's gonna be it from me for this episode i hope you enjoyed and stay safe goodbye